there is no reason to irrigate every day. I have heard this so many times, but do you agree? Stay with me in this video and I'll explain how long and how often you should irrigate your crops. As I explained in previous videos, agronomists calculate the amount of water to irrigate in millimeters. You can use millimeters per year, per month, per week, or per day. Let's explain two basic but very important agronomic concepts. The field capacity. This is the maximum water retention capacity of a soil and the permanent wilting point, which corresponds to the soil moisture limit from which the plant is not longer able to absorb water from the soil. If this condition persists, the plant wilts to death, with no chances of recovery. These are the two soil moisture limits at which the plant will take water from the soil. But but I am now going to invite you to think of the plant as if it was a person. If we don't have enough water to drink, we will get dehydrated. But on the other hand, if we are forced to drink too much water every day, it won't be pleasant either. So what is the ideal situation? Plants, just like people, need the right amount of water to feel good, depending on the climatic conditions, the type of the plant, and the phenological stage. So, if someone forces you to drink 15 liters of water straight away, and then left you for three days without no water, you wouldn't be very happy, would you? The same occurs with plants. Did you know that most of the energy consumed by the plants are at the root level and it is used to absorb water and nutrients? Based on this, you could say that the best situation for plants, as well as for the people, is to receive every day the right amount of water and nutrients that they need for that day. And the next day, the same thing. This task is not easy when you are using traditional irrigation system, but with high frequency localized irrigation system, and it can even be automated. If you want to go one step further, you can install soil moisture and electrical conductivity sensor, which will give you the necessary information to know exactly when and how much you need to irrigate. That will be the perfect situation for the plant. To conclude, we must avoid long and frequent irrigation and change them for shorter and more frequent irrigation to optimize the use of water and nutrients. If you want more information on irrigation system, visit our website asu.com and don't forget to join me on LinkedIn.